Hi and welcome to the 8-Bit Shack. Today I've got a short video on one of these. A hot plate for surface mount components. Um, this is something I bought off the internet, cost me about £20, about $25. I just took it out of the box. So I'm going to see how to set it up. So it takes a USB-C input and we have a display and two user buttons. So I'm going to plug in my USB-C and see what we have. Okay. So first of all, the display, it's a nice little display, uh, but it's coming up and I think that's, that's Chinese. So I'm going to try and change it to English and look at the rest of the settings. Now, from what I've read is you press these two push buttons at the back. Right, I've moved on my overhead camera now, just get a better picture of the display. So we have uh, some numbers here, 028, I'm guessing that's the ambient temperature, 12.3V, I'm guessing that's the voltage from the USB, 301 degrees C, I'm guessing that's the target temperature, and I think that is... Chinese and then we've got a couple of what looks to be um, graphs or bar graphs of some sort uh, along the bottom. So from what I've read um, if you press the two user buttons on the back with a long press it gets you into the setup menu. So let's just try that. So long press. Okay so we're into some setup menu. So it, it's shown PID so let's see what we've got. Oh, that's a Chinese. Oh, Chinese. Some more Chinese. Chinese. Back to PID. Okay then. So to go this way a couple of times. Try short press. Let's try short press. All right. So short press gets us into the sub menu. And it's CN, I'm guessing that's, that must be the language, so it's Chinese, so blah, blah, blah. oh, we've got English now, so I'm guessing short press again to select it. Right, so that's now, that's now selected, let's see what's on the next return, okay, that takes us to the next, that must take us back to the top menu, language, uh, okay, and see what else we've got, mode, mode, let's see what's in here, info. So that must be what's displayed on the display when it's working. Let's look at the curve. Okay, so we can show things as a curve. Return. Okay, so nothing else there. Mode. That was mode. So what's we got? Temp. What's in here? So max temp. So these must be the target temperatures. So, so the target temperature of 350 degrees C. Okay. Well, main term, let's see what's on that. Zero degrees, so it's okay. That's us. Return, okay, let's almost return us to the main menu. Temp. So we're back to PID. Okay, so that's the option. So we have, so we have PID, which is for the which is for the heat controller. Let's see what's on there. So we've got KP. I'm not going to set anything here. No, I'm not going to set anything. So we've got KP, on KI, and KD. So I'm, I'm not going to set them just yet. So we're back. So, okay, so that looks to be the option. So we've got PID back, which must take us back to the main screen. Language, mode, and temp. So let's go back to the main screen. Yep, and so everything looks to be in English now. So I'm just going to see what start. I think it was two long presses to start it. Right, so it's now showing heat, and that little bar has come on, and the temperature is starting to rise. And if you can see it, the little dis display there with this, dig with this C next to it, 
slowly stone the entries. Okay then. Okay, I'm not going to wait to see how long this takes to uh, heat up because I've already got a 12 volt supply um, on it, so I'm guessing it's going to take a couple of minutes. So there we have it. Um, a little hot plate for solar and surface mount components. Right. I think I might do um, a busy follow-up video. I, I have another hot plate um, that, that I use. Um, I'll, I'll share a picture of, of, of that one. And I'll do in our video where I compare these side by side. Until next, until next time then, um, thanks for watching. I hope, hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please consider leaving some feedback, a comment, or even subscribing to the 8-Bit Shack.